Hi, it's Kiffin Le Bates here. So uh, consider the following sequence. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. What do you think the next number is going to be? I was on a drive today and I was thinking about intelligence tests. You know, the kind of things that organizations like Mensa use to uh, decide whether you get to join their society or not. Um, and tests that schools run on their pupils in order to put them into various classes. Now, when I was younger, I was actually surprisingly bad at those kind of problems. And it wasn't until I had a realization um, that I actually managed to start scoring okay on these tests and actually have them reflect what I thought my intelligence was. And the problem I had was that I couldn't work out what amongst all the possible options would be the one to settle on. Because when you have a sequence of numbers um, and you get asked a question like that, there's a, an implicit thing behind it, which is that you and the person asking the question are dealing in the same culture, that you have the same view of the world or a similar view of the world and you both know what's expected from each other and when you're faced with a problem written down on a test like that it's been written by a person and they have a reason behind choosing what the next number is going to be and if in effect you have to do two things you have to work out what is the structural reasoning that they're using in order to create the problem and then you need to apply the uh, actual mechanical part in order to come up with a solution and for a lot of people this kind of stuff is fairly intuitive but uh, for me it wasn't once I actually realized that hey these guys are setting these problems because they're thinking like this finding what the next number in the sequence uh, was or what pattern or shape to select out of the ones put on offer um, became a lot lot simpler so um anyway the way i can illustrate that is that the next number in the sequence is actually 18 and the reason is that it's the houses on my street on the even numbered side but they knocked a couple of them down so uh if you didn't know that that was the context you probably went ahead and just quoted the next even number um I hope that was interesting see you in the next video soon bye for now